LeBron James is going to make his feature film debut in a movie with comedian Kevin Hart. I saw that look, by the way. I'm Kerry Chow, joined by ESPN NBA analyst George Carl. Uh, Coach, when you have a star player who acts in a major film during the off season, is it a distraction at all? How does that player? How does that performance usually affect the player on the court? You know, the, the game outside the outside the basketball court and outside you know the the team has grown so much that i mean it's a movie doing rap music uh, running marathons i mean they all are doing more and more things rather than just be a basketball player and i think lebron has credible help and incredible people behind him and i think he'll be able to probably manage the situation to to do a movie in the summertime but i mean there's no way pat riley is going to allow him to do a movie in the middle of the NBA season. I mean, and, and LeBron is a highly, highly focused NBA player. I mean, this man comes to play every night. I mean, his, his intensity, both physically and mentally, and, and a leader out there of, a, of the best team in basketball is pretty impressive to me. And speaking of that intensity, how will that translate to his acting abilities? Instead of George Carl, NBA analyst, we've got George Carl, film critic here. Wow. Ah. You know, I got. I was in two movies. I was in He's Got Game, and then I was in uh, an Eddie Murphy movie with Melo and AI. And you know, a movie takes a lot. It's a, it's very tedious and very you know very slow moving. So I think he'll be fine because I think the camera, the guy behind the camera, can make the guy in front of the camera look pretty good. Um, but in the same sense, uh, you know, I, 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 I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, my life outside of basketball is very minimal, and watching movies is not a part of it right now. Speaking of He Got Game yeah, and that performance, uh, it was one line, but wh how long did that whole – what was that process like? You know, Spike Lee was at ABC CD basketball camp in somewhere in New Jersey, um, and he took a lot of NBA coaches and some players and went in a back room and just asked you to read some lines. So it took about five minutes. The paperwork filling out how you had to join the, the Actors Guild or something like that to yeah. get paid, that took more time than actually doing the movie. But coming in, just deliver the lines and done. That was done. It. And then, you know, he, he, he cut it and I saw the movie and I was in it. I didn't, know, I, I didn't get any information that I was going to be in the movie, that I was definitively in the movie until I saw the movie. And you like your performance? Uh, my, my daughter does. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff. ESPN NBA analyst and thespian George Carl. LeBron James making movies.